it is very powerful. But before I start on that, I want to say that if you're just writing a message, copying it and pasting it and just spamming people, it's actually going to be the, you know, the drastic opposite for you. Uh, you need to be personal and you're essentially given a platform to talk to whatever, whatever that person is, a celebrity, a brand, another person, you know, somebody you look up to, somebody you look down on, whatever it is, like it's giving you that opportunity. There's no guarantee that said person is going to reply back to you, but it's a lot more likely that they would reply to you if you've actually sent a message as opposed not to. So going into real estate, you know, I pretty much bugged somebody for almost two years because they were a real estate investor. They were doing quite a bit of work, not only in my area, but all over the country. And I'm like, man, that would be so great to work with these people and to do some of the things that they're doing. And uh, I actually did a deal with them probably a, a year, about a year after, uh, which was something that I brought to them. And I just, you know, kept on it. Like, hey, what's up? You guys need anything? You know, and uh, about about year two, they reached out to me and they're like, hey, we have this listing in Laguna Beach. We want you to take it. And I was like, great. Like anybody who calls you for, you know, come listen, call it's great. Well, they're like, yeah, we're thinking it's about $2 million. Uh, what do you think? Well, I went and I looked and did, you know, my research and whatnot. And I was like, I think I could sell this thing for like 2.8 million. They're like, no, that's impossible. Uh, long story short, I sold it for 2825 and that was through social media like that's how we connected i had another person that i sold another house to she uh, multiple people do this you know hey i've been following you for like a year and a half and we're you know we're ready to sell a house like and we've never talked um you know if you have that person that's just commenting or liking your stuff like i don't personally recommend going jumping into dms like hey you like the you know you like the house on 123 Main Street, the video that I just posted, are you gonna buy a sell or a house right now? Like, I don't like like doing it that way. Um, I just like using it just for, just opportunities. I mean, I've, I've talked to what I would believe some phenomenal people through social media that has led to where I'm standing right now. And a lot of that does come back to just reaching out. Uh, if they don't reach out, like I wouldn't just start <laughs> sending them a message every single day, but you know, what you need to do through social media and in your DMs is, you know, don't reach out with a question. Reach out like, this is how I can provide value to you. Hey, this is what I was thinking. You did this and what if I can do this for you? Like reach out to provide value through your channels and that's gonna reciprocate and that's gonna lead to referrals. Um, so the DM should not be you initially just like, hey, what can you do for me? It's like, hey, this is what I can do for you. I saw you post this or I saw this happen. Like. This is what I'm thinking, what are your thoughts? And that'll lead to a lot better interactions on direct message as opposed to you getting blocked. <laughs>